for some all new Cornell presidential pimping. Because <laughs> I'm running for office. It's Cornell. My name Cornell. Ha, I'm doing well. Hey, ha, and I feel it in my gut. I'm going up. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? My name is Cornell. I'm always doing well. And wait, I forgot to do something today. Oh, blow up, son. <laughs> Come on! It's President's Day Monday. We all get to sit around and think about the greatness of our former presidents and all the wonderful things they've done for themselves. And no truly great presidents are too few and far between, but stay positive, America. We've had wonderful and flawless presidents. I mean, it's not like any of them have ever lied to America, robbed us through taxes, cheated to get in office, committed adultery with a secretary, got freak nasty with Marilyn Monroe, inhaled illegal substances, own slaves or send our children to war. I mean, come on, America, what's wrong with you? Now we got this ballin' MC named Obama in office. This dude just walks into a room and everybody fixed their tie. Came in talking about change. I was feeling that till I realized he was talking about taking my change. Don't get me wrong, America, I love the guy, but I mean, come on, everybody's making a big deal out of him. I mean, it's not like he's the first black president we've ever had, huh? He is the first black president? Who was the one that was smoking all that weed? He was white? I right, learn something new every day. <laughs> hey, baby. I personally admire Obama. He's like the Ronald McDonald of presidents. He makes us all feel good, even though none of us know who he really is. Everybody seems to be talking about how Obama's not doing so great. I'm not going to say he's not doing a great job. I'm just going to say I wish he was giving out more checks. Because <laughs> I need that dope. Came in over office making it rain on us. Must have been like enough is enough. I can only make it rain once every turn. You gotta re-elect me for four more years for that type of bother. All I'm saying is with a black president, I thought America might look a little bit different than it does. I thought maybe we might get a complimentary chicken dinner of sorts. I was hoping for at least five new black entertainment television stations. Maybe a two for one discount on some Air Jordans. I don't know. I'm not the president. Let me tell y'all honestly what I am disappointed in. I'm a little bit let down about the skills that this guy really has. I mean, when did this album come out? Where's the sneaker deal? Where's the vitamin water? I don't know what's wrong with this guy. You get one chance to be president. This how you gonna deal with the media exposure? I think all black people should have an Obama light that was shining in the sky whenever we need his assistance. Probably only does limited service in the projects. Even Batman don't go there. I think people are just disappointed because he talks so much about change. But let's just keep this all in perspective. We as black people are amazing at talking about things that we will do. Half the fights we win in life is from job talking. I'm going to let y'all in on a little secret, America. We don't plan on doing s***. Worst case scenario, we might slap a couple people, but that's as far as we're going to go as long as money ain't involved. People seem to be upset because he's not doing anything, but, I mean, come on, what would you expect him to do? Let me tell y'all something. If I ever get elected president, I'm not doing nothing either. I'm installing a flat screen TV in the Oval Office and a recliner, and I'm watching Entourage. Anybody got a problem with it, I'm also installing a big red button right by me that says Duke Nukem. I'll tear this whole place up. So vote for me, Quanell for president. <laughs> That's all the time we have, ladies and gentlemen. Don't forget to go to youtube.com slash Quanell Show, subscribe to my channel, and rate this video. You should also comment me this week on what you would like for me to do if I was your president of the United States of America. Gotta keep your boy doing what he do, talking trash about nothing in particular. Peace. <laughs> this garment makes me look so sexy. I can't believe I found it on somebody's doorstep. I really don't remember even putting up that background. I'm <laughs>